Hey everybody! Um, today I'm going to be making uh, banana bread. My daughter has been craving banana bread. And whenever you have any leftover bananas, I mean that are really ripe, it's a great way to use them. And so what I do is I, I go online and I just I find um, a banana, a simple banana bread recipe. Or if you've been making it for a long time, you don't need to go online. Get your bananas. I got about four bananas. It calls for two to three bananas. So what I do is I get them in a bowl and I smash them with a fork. So that's the first thing you gotta do. And smash the bananas. Get those bananas smashed. Alright. They're easier if they're ripe. Um, so I'm going to smash the bananas. And then look on your recipe. It says bananas, two to three peeled bananas and ripe. It says third melted butter. So you don't want to put in cold butter. So I put it in a little container. And just put it in the microwave. If you have it out already, room temperature, then that's great. But if you don't, then just put it in the microwave for like about 20 seconds. That's probably good. Or less. If it starts popping, obviously, you know it's done. So, there you got the melted butter. I just pour that in with the bananas. With the bananas. Pour it in there. Stir it around. Mmm. Smells amazing already. There's something about bananas and melted butter that already smell like out of the oven baked banana bread. One egg. Bam. Put that there. Stir that around. If you want to use a, a mixer, that's fine. But I'm just, I'm just taking a fork and doing it simple. Because I'm all about simple, get it done. It's going to all taste the same. So yeah. Alright, so what else? So, so far I've got an egg, I've got butter. Da 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 da. Oh, I need sugar. So, I never measure. So about a third of sugar there, bam, a little thing of sugar. All right, and vanilla extract. I usually just take the lid, pour it into the lid, and then bam, drop it. Drop it like it's hot, drop it like it's hot. And then you're gonna want to preheat the oven. Mm. Where is my recipe, girl? I lost my recipe. Okay. Banana bread. I went to um, Simple Recipes to find this banana bread recipe. Simple Recipes. Um, I like to make it different all the time. Um, you could add chocolate chips to it, it says. Baking soda and salt and one and a half all-purpose flour. All right? One and a half all-purpose flour and baking soda. Bam! One a half. Okay, so I used the same, um, there we go. Mix it together! It's looking so good. Some baking soda and salt. Who doesn't love salt and sweet? Mm. I love it. Okay. So a little bit of salt. A little pinch of salt, but I'm not going to throw it over the shoulder like Rachel does because I don't have a cleaning crew to come and clean it. So... I'm not going to do that. But if you're superstitious, 
Then you go for it, girl. So now some baking soda. Whoa. A little bit of that. I put too much. So stir it all. Stir it all together and everybody knows the beautiful look of banana bread. It's delicious. All right, so my daughter wants walnuts. You don't have to have walnuts, but mm, have one before. You don't have to, but if you love them, I usually take about a handful and a half of almonds, raw almonds. Stir it all around. Mmm. Smells delicious. Banana, nutty. All right, double check. Make sure I got everything on my recipe. Pinch of salt, flour. Did I get vanilla? I believe I did, yeah. Um, do, 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 do. And that's it, girl. And then we bake it for at 350 for about one hour. All right, so before you put it in your pan, spray that bad boy. I have some olive oil spray. So I spray it. Just a regular loaf pan. Ooh, I make the best meatloaf in this too, this pan. I need to make that for you sometime. Oh my gosh. So good. So good. Alright, I'm putting it in the pan. So good. Bake it for an hour and so it's one o'clock here my time. So by the time my daughter gets home, she will have banana bread. Oh my gosh, it's gonna be so good. This is why I, I absolutely adore working from home because I get this kind of stuff done personal touches that she deserves to get and then you get to mm, lick the fork grab behind the nuts and voila it's done I put it in the oven mm, over here 350 I set the timer for one hour Oh. There's got to be a faster way, I'm sure. And push the start button. Mm. So bye for now. Thanks for coming with me to make banana bread. I love you guys. Mwah! Make some delicious treats for yourself and for your family. It's wonderful.